I'm fine. How are you? I'm ready to go. You want to get going? Oh, it's a bit there too, too early, so. All right. It's cold outside. <laughs> All right. It's cold inside, too. It is not cold in this house. In this house right now, it is 73. That's hot. And outside right now, hold on, I'm trying to get my phone to the weather app. It's 61 outside right now, and it's going to be a high of 70 degrees outside today. So, <laughs> it's not cold. Okay guys, so we got the vlog up finally and we are in the car on our way to the hospital for my bladder surgery. Yay! Not excited. Apparently he is. <laughs> but I'm very, very tired because I had a hard time sleeping last night. I was falling asleep while Kevin and I were watching the final cut of the vlog. And then I had to get up so I can watch the final cut because I kept falling asleep. <laughs> and then once I got up to watch it, that was it. I couldn't go back to sleep. <laughs> so I was up for a while. And then I think my mind was just going <laughs> So, anyway, they're going to be putting me out. So you get your sleep. <laughs> yeah, I'll sleep. So, Kevin and Megan are going to have to go this weekend and pick out the Christmas tree. Probably without me. We'll see how I feel. And, I don't know, maybe they might have to decorate or I might call Lori. Have her come decorate. It all depends on how you're feeling. Yeah. Because my uh, experience with you in these things, you're going to be down for the full three days. And you're not going to want to get out of bed. Well, that's why I said I might call Lori and have her decorate. Because Megan's going to be studying, so she won't be able to de decorate. And... As many years as we've been married, I don't think you could decorate the way I decorate. I love you, but I still don't think you could do it. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see how I do. I built your crematorium. Yes, you did. Yes, that you did. And it was a very beautiful crematorium. Well, thank you. I'm hungry. <laughs> what did you just say? You said it's warm in here. I can't believe I heard those words come out of your mouth. It happens. It gets warm. Wow. I see you brought Daryl with you to watch your back. Watch, watch my back, my front, my side, you know. All right. Well, All around. <laughs> we're almost there, so you're going to have to pick Daryl off. You didn't get your groovy hat this time. Not yet. I may. Mean. Think you're going to get one? I might. Yeah. <laughs> Got to be styling, you know. Thirsty? Still not wearing your groovy hat yet. Oh, they didn't give me one yet. But I got my groovy thing on my finger. Oh, oh your little finger thing. Yeah. A little finger puppet. Yeah. <laughs> and they're gonna come give me an RV. Ooh. That's good. Luckily, I'm not afraid of needles. Will I get to play with your IV again? <laughs> as long as you don't try and plug me into your truck again. Oh, uh, it's downstairs. Right? <laughs> I'm not gonna be able to reach it this time. <clears throat> Weirdo. <laughs> so they're gonna come give me some la la medicine. How will we know? How will <laughs> I we know. know when it takes effect? <laughs> Is that the good stuff? You won't know. That's the problem. Well, I know. <laughs> so how 
How do I know you have the lala medicine? I can feel it. <laughs> <laughs> so you know you have the lala medicine. Yeah. You still don't have a groovy hat yet. Why don't you have a groovy hat? I don't know. But I feel so feel relaxed. All right. Well, let you relax and turn the light off. Do I look like... Yes. They, we had to tie you down because you were floating around the room. <laughs> I don't think that's true. <laughs> How would you know? <laughs> See you all when I get back. Okay. Bye for now. Bye. Yet. Did you forget? I keep making Kevin turn the camera on because I keep forgetting things. So. See y'all later. Can you feel that? <laughs> Can you feel that? They gave me. Can you feel that? <laughs> They gave me some more la la medicine. <laughs> so it's lights out. <laughs> Alright, baby. Maybe I should turn the light. Bye. Bye. Where's your hat? Oh, they took it off already. Jeez. <laughs> but they put my my uh, oxygen cuff on my ear thingy I here. I see, you have. Because they couldn't get a good oxygen reading on my fingers. I don't know why. <laughs> but I'm still kind of sleepy. But I'm thirsty and I feel like I have to pee. But <laughs> And I'm hungry. Oh, no, too bad. And, and, and the nurse says that it's in my doctor's, doctor's orders that lobster. Yeah, right. Is, I believe is, that. Yeah. <laughs> what do you have to say about that? She can't do it today, so she gets a rain check. Oh, there you go. You'll have to wait. You'll have to wait. At least but she does get days. it. She does get it. Yeah. I do get it. See? I do have to have my lobster dinner for recovery. Uh -huh. <laughs> Hello. Hi. So it's a pretty day out here today. Got some clouds in the sky, but it is nice. It gets all the air gets all clean after a rain. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's a nice day. Too bad I'm gonna go spend the rest of it in bed. Sorry. Hello everybody. Hello. Come on, come on. <laughs> It's time for shout outs. Yay! Come on, come on, come on. We can do this. <laughs> we can get through this. <laughs> okay. It's time for shout outs. You, you said that. Oh. It, okay, it's time for shout outs. Smart Mom 1981. Welcome to the neighborhood. Ellie, Lucy Owl Blue Bones sister, welcome to the neighborhood. Now, there's just a few youngsters that I want to give a quick little shout out to because they all started their YouTube channels after um, they started watching us and they said that we've inspired them. They all decided that if we could do it, anybody could do it. And it is true. I mean, you know, we we just kind of picked up the camera and started talking, and Whoa. yeah, and I, I don't stop talking, so that's um, it helps with to be that way. I'm the quiet one. She's not. All right, do your thing. Um. So, but the first one I want to do, uh, Megan Magic X needs. Five more subscribers to get to 30 by Christmas. That's her goal. So you guys all got to go and subscribe to her. And just a few people I want to do quick shout outs to. Um, 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 um. Definitely Christopher Trade Show. Definitely Lucy Owl Blue Bones. Dana B. Saw. Um, Andromeda. I don't know what Andromeda's last name is, but you know who you are. Lloyd Jake, Katie Caroline, Rex25059, Tanya Ray, um, 
I don't remember him. Okay. If, if she misses you. Unedited her. Life 01. Definitely Unedited Life 01. Okay, I think that's about it. Amy Martin. <laughs> I could go on and on and on. All right, where are we at now? <laughs> okay, uh, we got tagged by Lucy Owl Blue Bones to do a Christmas tag. Oh, okay. Well, so we, we need to prepare. So play some music while we change. Go ahead. Did I scare you? Go ahead. Don't hit me with Keep your going. paw. Keep going. Okay. So three questions. What are our Christmas traditions? What are our Christmas traditions? Oh, well, I'd say probably the same as a lot of people. We decorate. Of course, now it's probably just going to be I'm decorating while Val watches. Uh, Christmas tree. Uh, we uh, love putting up the Christmas tree, of course, uh, dress, well, dressing bones as Santa. I, well, I, okay, well, okay. Kevin usually does the outside decorations. Mm. I usually do the inside decorations. Okay. But it's usually a tradition. Kevin, Megan, and I go and buy a real Christmas tree, a live one, and we put the Christmas tree up, and then we all decorate it. Yeah. Okay. So that's what we do with the Christmas tree. Okay, and what is our favorite Christmas movies? Let me go first? Please. I'll go first. My favorite Christmas movie of all time ever, ever, ever is White Christmas with Bing Crosby, Danny Kaye, Rosemary Clooney, and I forget the other one's name. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but that's my favorite movie, and that's also Megan's favorite movie. She's not here to tell you that, but it's been a tradition since Megan was like five years old. Every Christmas, we would sit and watch White Christmas together, just her and I, until, you know, Kevin came into the picture, and then he would watch it with us, but every year, White Christmas Favorite, favorite movie. Favorite song. Love that song. Oh, that was another one that she that was on there. I don't, I don't think I wrote that down. Favorite Christmas song. Um, but that's my favorite Christmas song as well. White Christmas, Bing Crosby. I'm really loopy, guys. I'm sorry. Your turn. Are you done? I think so. Oh, well, if I think of something, I'll let you know. Well, you know, the favorite Christmas movie, uh, is, it's hard to say because I grew up when um, the uh, Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer, all that claymation stuff, just came out. I was six years old when that came out. And I saw it on TV when it first came out. The following year, uh, a, a, a Charlie Brown Christmas came out. And I would say, when I was a kid, if, if I didn't get to see those two movies, it was not Christmas. And that's just all there was to it. And then, of course, uh, Rankin Bass, who did the... the uh, um, Rudolph won, did a whole bunch of others the following couple of years. And of course, they you don't see stuff like that anymore. And I like watching Scrooged with Bill Murray. That's very funny. My favorite musical Christmas time is Scrooge, without the D, with Albert Finney. Um, um, song. Song? My favorite Christmas song. Uh, somebody said Carol of the Bells, I have to say. I really like Carol of the Bells. I think Lucy said that. Yeah. Was it Lucy? She's the only one who did the tag that we oh. watched. Alright. So Lucy, he agrees with you. Okay. Uh, what is, do we do on Christmas Eve? That's a little hard to answer because... Um, Can't hit him with the book. I almost <laughs> hit him with the book. See how loopy I am? I almost <laughs> forgot. Keep, keep going. Keep going. I almost got you in the bed. Okay. Um, what do we do on Christmas Eve? Well, when Megan is not here, Mom will come over sometimes. We'll have an early dinner. 
um, she'll go home and then Kevin and I will just watch some TV and stuff. We don't open any presents or anything until mm -hmm. Megan comes back from her dad's. But when Megan is here, then we have a nice Christmas dinner or Christmas Eve dinner. And we open one gift from under the tree. I get to pick which one everybody opens because I know what's one what is in every package because I wrap everything myself. And then we sit down and watch Christmas movies together. And then we'll all go to bed. And even though Megan's 20 years old, she still wakes us up nice and early for Christmas morning. If she doesn't, Bootsy always does. <laughs> And yes, all of our animals do get Christmas gifts. Okay. Okay. Are we done? We're done with that. Do your thing. Do my. Th are we doing the thing in the other hats? Oh, okay. Okay. We got us. We got to make it. Make a wardrobe change. Play some music. Okay. It's time for the Neighborhood Community Credit Roll. It is? Yes. <laughs> hey, do your thing. Um, okay, um, you are all part of our Neighborhood Community, each and every one of you. Oh, did you guys notice Santa Claus put on some weight? Sorry. Did you notice Santa Claus put on some weight? He yeah. ate a squirrel. <laughs> he... He loses weight all summer long, so now he has the month of December, and he's eating us out of house and home. Boy, oh boy, Disney's going to sue us for the plot of uh, <laughs> Santa Claus. Go ahead. Keep going. You are all part of our neighborhood community, each and every one of you. We would not be here if it weren't for you all. We love you. Oh. He, he, he. he likes doing that. He, he, he. We love you all. Thank you so very much. Thumbs up, and we will see you all tomorrow. Grrrr. Grrrr.